What mine looks like this. If I'm walking. Walk slower, will you? Well, that's how I would use Okay, I'll walk like this. I'm on record, so I can't. Wait, I could only see. Wait, something is funny. Something is nearby you. Just to learn. No. Stay still. Stay still for a moment. Stay still. Mafa? Mafa, are you there? Yeah, but turn the camera around to me. Because I know, I know, I can't even knock up. Hi, this is Felicia from the extraterrestrial group. I'm speaking for myself and my sister Sophie about possible abduction or unabduction. We're not sure really. Um, the first picture, of course, you see that Asian women and the Polaroid, um, they, or they're trying to say Polaroid. Now this reminded me, this shot reminded me of the last UFO we, we both seen at the age of 18. Um, we saw a couple before that too, but this was different because it was so bright and shining and we have... Re little recollection of it though I thought I remember everything but we don't know everything because we don't know what we were doing at that certain period of time now the picture after that was supposed to be my sister but it's not my sister and this one here is what the alien seems to do a lot is they they hide themselves behind these white silhouette and so you cannot see what kind of aliens they are um, these are possibly something else but of course these three people are not they're probably aliens too now again here's an Asian uh, women they seem to have this thing for Asian or I don't know if they're mocking us or mocking all Asians but we do tend to see a lot of slanted eyes and things like that so um, and also if some people notice at night the the outside looks dark like that reddish uh, foggy hue to it um, that's also a sign that's, that there's a being hiding somewhere and a possible abduction may happen so be aware and also the upside down cross means antichrist now I don't know if they knew that when when they put that in there um, and also this is uh, was something this must mean something um, but I don't know if anybody knows. Now this is a Sigma of some kind that my sister recently took a photo of a UFO with those three blue aliens in there, but it looked too, too UFO, so I don't know if that meant, you know, they're trying to fool us a little bit, but they seem to have a similar Sigma as the one you just saw. Now, of course, here's another sexual innuendo thing with this, uh, you know what that is. Um, now here, they're showing a larva, it looks like a larva, and on the left hand side looks like an, an ultrasound type of thing, on the, the red uh, flaming rod, I don't know what that is. Um, now here's my myself here with 
my hand looking like a hammer and of course that's not my hand and we see that also often even my twin sister just recently we saw that on her it was kind of really creepy it was more close up and here's my twin sister looking lifeless and as though just a total zombie um, and uh, of course the vehicle that you see the other ones were not of ours or anything that I do have a large vehicle but there was another one that's not mine and of course here even though I don't have no recollection of this you can see I have an emotion and I do I am seeing something and it's those blue creatures and you can see my eyes starting to slowly turn bluer and my eyes are not blue it's totally brown and so as these creatures comes closer and closer and the funny thing is I have a photo of them I have taken a while back ago in the bushes and I never when I saw it it dawned on me that that's the same creature that's on the on this clips here and um, and they must have been coming very close to me now here um, the dates are very crucial to to um, see because here it's supposed to be a 12 at the end because these are the dates now that looks like a four to me so something obviously happened uh, now here's my eyes getting bluer now on the bottom that's a waffle on my chin you heard a lot about the waffle we were saying and they're an extraterrestrial uh, being that are, have a metamorphous ability and uh, now here's my eyes very blue so this thing must have been very close to me and this lizard skin, I don't really understand what was the purpose of that. But, and now this shot really just, I almost wanted to vomit. I mean, you can see the, the whiteness, uh, they're trying to cover up whoever they are and trying to look human. But obviously some of them look like mushrooms in the back. And the rest of these um, are just random shots thinking maybe somebody might also have a similar one but I but the whole thing is you know people do get abducted and I believe in that but the thing is this is a totally different kind of abduction or even just a possible abduction but what's scary is you feel like you just no longer have a, a, a control of your own self anymore it's like somebody can take control of yourself of you and not even know it you think everything is going normal, you go inside, everything is normal, I had a great time, you know, for five, ten minutes, and you didn't, then this shows up, and you realize it wasn't.